Greetings YouTube, it's another wind turbine video. Uh, I'm still on crutches unfortunately. The good news is the pigeons have abandoned ship. There is their beautiful nest. So at the moment the turbine is just running connected to these batteries set up as a 12 volt system and then if I were to put those in as well that would make a 24 volt system. They actually feel warm, they're not hot. I'm just going to put the camera on the meter and leave it a minute and then I may uh, switch the batteries. If it keeps going, if it goes over 100 uh, watts regularly I'll switch it up to 24 volts. Excuse me. Yeah, if it constantly goes over 100 watts I'll put it on 24 volts, if not I'll just leave it at this. In fact, there's a pretty easy way we can tell. I'm just going to disconnect the battery. I'm going to disconnect. This one runs from the uh, battery pack to the controller setup. So when I uh, disconnect this, that should allow it to run free. So we'll see what it goes up to. So, right. Right, so we're going to leave it a minute and see if it has a little splurge and goes above 24. And then if it does, we can change the battery pack over. It's not looking likely. I mean, that's not bad. That's 20 volts just pottering around like that. 24, 27, 27, 27, 26, 32, 36. Let's show that. So yeah, now that's in full flow. Yeah, that's running beautifully. Now 45, 44, 46, 46, 48, 49. She's a beauty, my friends. She's a beauty. And deserves to be more widely spread. So now it's slowing down a bit. You can see it's still that. So I'm going to try and connect up the other battery back. This one, this two, it's down, the one, it's negative, so, and it's up, so, this one goes to, that goes to there, and that's negative, yes, wait, it's so long, so, the positive of the 24 volt pack starts here, goes through there, that positive connects to, sorry, that negative, misleading color wire, that negative connects to that positive there by the bird's nest and then this becomes the, so we'll stick with that for a minute just to see what it's doing. Again, I've had a lot of uh, negative comments about the two sets of blades, the smaller set at the front and the larger set, but it just seems to work very well. And now it's slowing down to now. It'll be interesting to see what the batteries are registering because the top set here, they've had no charge for months because of the pigeons. So we'll just record for a bit longer, see if we get a bit of wind and then uh, just wanted to show you it's still working fine and had any maintenance, haven't taken it down or done anything to it whatsoever. It easily hits the 28 volts. As you saw when I disconnected it from the load, it went straight up to 45, no problem. So there you go, that's just another video to say thanks for the people who do watch and like I say I'm not going to be doing anything physical for a long time. So this is the uh, this is where it's at regarding the action. Uh, one day I may connect this up just because I know people find that interesting. 
uh, the 12 uh, 24 volt controller at the moment I've got it running through a rectifier so yeah she's a beast my friends there you go 32 volts 400 watts 12 amps no problem at all 600 watts so bye for now and have a great weekend my friends sweet <laughs>